the Indian leadership reaffirms its commitment to these agreements. Russia's foreign minister spoke on a major defense deal with India. India is set to purchase five S-400 missile defense systems from Russia. The deal, reportedly worth $5.43 billion, was inked in Delhi in October 2019. Delhi's significant defense deals with Moscow have seen opposition from USA. The then Trump government in US had threatened to impose sanctions on India for the S-400 deal. Washington earlier reportedly imposed sanctions on China and Turkey for a similar deal. It remains to be seen what current US President Joe Biden's stand will be on the issue. Russia's foreign minister said that India had reaffirmed its commitment to the agreement. What is the outcome of the meeting when you have differences in the two key players between India and China, especially on the issue of sovereignty and territorial integrity? And another two quick questions, when is India going to get S-400? And when is Sputnik starting production in India? We didn't have any disputes when negotiating this important document. This was the second document on strengthening of the multilateral system. I think it has also from particular importance because all BRICS member states stressed the need to strengthen the multilateral system, not in an abstract or a narrow format, but exclusively in the universal format based on the UN Charter. As for our cooperation with India, both with regard to economic, political, humanitarian, military, technical cooperation and healthcare cooperation, it um, is developing gradually and in accordance with all arrangements reached at the top level. I will note uh, in particular implementation of uh, the S-14 and delivery deals and here we see no changes. The Indian leadership reaffirms its commitment to these agreements and uh, right today we are sending another a shipment of um, Sputnik V vaccine to our Indian friends as a follow-up to massive steps that we have already made to provide assistance to India in the context of the situation in which India has found itself.